Hello friends in previous video I have show you how to insert data into my SQL table using PHP data object. Now in this video I will show you how to fetch data from my SQL table and PHP by using this PHP data object modal. Friends this is my simple database name testing and in this I have table with name table employee with four fields like id, name, gender and designation. I have already inserted some data into this table. I will fetch this data from this table to web page using PHP data model. Friends first I have to make database connection. For this first I have to define host name username password and database name. For this I have write host is equal to localhost, username is equal to root, password is equal to blank and database is equal to testing. Friends we have used PHP data object so first I have write try and catch block. In this if there is any error in try block code then we can easily identify and catch block. First I have write code and try block, in this I have write my SQL database connection code. First I have write variable connect is equal to new PHP data object with open and close bracket and between bracket there first parameter like I have write database driver name my SQL with host is equal to server name which I have defined above after this I have write database name is equal to variable database in which I have defined database name. Second parameter is username and last parameter is password, both I have already defined above. After this now I want to set the PHP data object error to exception. For this I have write connection string dollar $connect with set attribute function. In this function there is two parameter. First is PHP data object with two times double colon attribute error mode and second is PHP data object two time colon error mode exception. Friends suppose there is any error in database connection or insert data so we can easily handle by PHP data object exception. For I have defined PHP data object exception at catch by writing open and close bracket and between bracket I have write PHP data object exception with defined one object of this exception like dollar error. So friends if there is any database error occur so we can simply get error message by using this PHP data object exception object dollar error. But now I want to print her message for I have go catch block and simply write echo statement and use PHP data object exception object which is dollar error. So simply write dollar error with get message function. With help of this function we get specific error message. Now friends you can show database connection successfully done. Now I have show you how to select data from table by using PHP data object. First I have show you select all data from table. For fetch all data from table so I have write query variable in this variable I will store simple SQL query like select star from table employee. With the help of this query we can fetch all data from table. Now friends I want to execute this query and store data into one data variable. So for this I have write data variable is equal to database connection string with object operator with query function with parameter SQL query which I have stored into query variable. This query function executes an SQL statement returning a result set as a PDO statement object. After execute query first I want to print table with attribute width is equal to 70%, border is equal to 1, cell padding is equal to 5, cell spacing is equal to 5. In this table I have write 4 column with name id, 
Name, Gender and Designation Now friends I have used for each loop, with help of this loop we can access all the fields of associative array. So I have write for each with open and close bracket and between bracket I have write data variable as dollar row variable. With help of for each loop we can access dollar data variable fields with reference of row variable. In this loop I want print data in table format for this I have write echo statement with open and close table row tag and between this tag I have write for table data tag and in first table data table I have write row with it column name. In second table data tag I have write row variable with field name. In third table data tag I have write row variable with field name gender and in four table data tag I have write row with table column name designation. And lastly I want to close table tag for this I have write echo statement with close table tag. Now friends save this code and see output in browser. Friends you can show we can fetch all data from table to this web page by using PHP data object. Now suppose you want to select single records by using PHP data object model. So now I have show you how select single data from table using PHP data object. Friends for selecting single records I have used prepare statement of PHP data object. So first I have write statement variable is equal to database connection string which is dollar connect with object operator with prepare statement with open and close bracket and between bracket I have write query like select star from table employee where it is equal to double colon id. Here I have used name place holder and prepare statement. Now friends I want to execute this prepare statement query, for this I have write statement variable with object operator with execute function with open and close bracket and between bracket I have write it is equal to 1 in array format like this. This execute function executes a prepared statement. Now I want to display data in table format so I have simply copy above code here and remove data variable and write dollar statement variable in which we have store select data result from for each loop. I have saved this code on check output in browser. Friends you can see only one data is display with it is equal to 1 suppose friends you want to get data of it is equal to 5. So I have simply go to PHP coding part and change an array with it from 1 to 5 and execute function and save this code on check output in browser. Friends you can see employee data with it is equal to 5. So this way you can fetch data from my SQL table by using the one PHP. So, this is my video on how to select all or select single data from table and display on web page in PHP by using PHP data object modal. So friends thank you for watching this video. If you have any query regarding this video you can comment on this video I will reply on your comment. Friends you want to get more update of my video, so, friends you can subscribe my YouTube channel. Friends you can also like my Facebook page also or you can also follow Webslist.